Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hello if you are new. My name is Jess and today we're continuing our journey in World of Warcraft in the Emerald Dream. I appreciate you clicking on this video and joining me on this Let's Play. We are trying to finish off the Emerald Dream today. I think we can. We have two achievements to go. Enemy forces are once again gathering their strength. I must get closer. Weaken them before they reach their full potential. This is so cool, like fighting with everyone. Like Pelagos, Lady Jaina. Pull up, buddy. I require a target. We'll burn this turn. You are all useless. Move aside. These worms dare to challenge me. My will shall be their ruin. Rock has breached the temple. Holf Aldon Shi. Farak has broken through the barrier. He must have become desperate once he saw our forces closing in to use that much shadow flame all at once. Okay, I think we we're gonna go for the offhand just to finish off our set. Fair skies and strong winds. Farak may have entered the temple, but our fight has not ended. Thanks to your efforts, we have broken through his forces. There is still time to stop him. You must gather your allies and follow Farak into the Wellspring Temple. We will cover your flank. Know that this is not only a Medrasil that you protect this day. All of Azeroth will burn if Farak claims the World Tree. We, he must be stopped here and now. This is our final stand. Also, we just got an achievement, so we literally only have one to go. go. What would you ask Run of the day. Kalmora? Amandrasil has bloomed beyond the confines of the dream. Let us venture to the Dragon Isles and see where this new world tree has taken root. We will fight to protect our future. Interesting this popped up before we killed Farak, but we'll watch. That was epic looking, but I don't completely know what just happened. Where do we go? Mirror so... Oh, we have to do the raid. The Mirror so the Dream's Hope. I'm guessing, I don't know if we can even...
I mean, we're high enough level, I guess we could try to find a group. Why not? Um, I guess we need to go to an Iron Plains for the rest of the um, campaign. I'm so confused. Probably should have gone to the fly path, but I'm just hitting us down here. And now, oh, there's so many people doing the um, blooms at the minute. Um, to hand in our worthy ally quest, and I think head towards the portal ish. But we still have like a couple glyphs and areas to unlock as well. Oh, going the wrong way. This kind of feels um, similar to in Zerolink Caverns where we had to kill Sarkareth, but like also didn't. Like we had to go through the raid, but then we never actually killed him. Like he was just kind of dead. Like there's just a few weird glitchy things with the story, it, it feels. Cool beans, okay. Um. Oh, we got a splintered spark, that's cool. And a cape upgrade. Love that. Okay. Greetings. The balance must be maintained. I don't know, I guess we go to an iron plains. in the plains. Oh, just down here. Our flight stands unified once more. Merithra's face lights up. Champion, we are among the very first to see a Mirdrasil here on Azeroth. This is truly a precious moment. For a Mirdrasil. The arrival of the Mirdrasil brings great change to Azeroth. Its roots are finding a home in the soil beneath even a home in the soil beneath, even as its branches stretch skyward to taste the air. This is an auspicious moment, but we must not forget our allies from the Isles. Visit with those nearby to ensure they are safe and sound. Is it time to go? Fly swiftly. Okay, so we need to go check on the center. I feel like we're wrapping this up. This definitely feels like the end. I just wish they didn't do it until we'd killed Farak. Daughters of Tira smile on you. The dragons restored their oaths, now they restore a people. Is everything alright? Follow the wind. Onahara led us here, it seems we were witness we were to witness this great event. Catalog is visited. Okay, where are they? Down here.
to target something Didn't first. even try! Good to see you again! Have you found the film? We can't miss this moment. Keep taking pictures! Now back to capturing the very first photos of the New World Tree. Oh whoa, it's like right there. I completely missed it. Did this actually change like it wasn't there until we finished the Emerald Dream? I'm just curious because um, I, I never paid attention to whether it was there or not. <laughs> Yikes. Can we make it? Yes. You see tree big and pretty smell like life. Friend mate, you see tree? <laughs> tree explains much. Me leave Knowles to find life tree, but rot oh, talk too fast. Cool. If the knolls are fine. Uh, whoa, where are we going over here? Her blog visited. I don't think the Farak raid is going to happen looking at this. The raid finder. It's going to take a little bit too long. For something like this to exist, the dragons have indeed returned. Is everyone alright? We've come from Longshore Island, we heard whispers that something was soon to happen, but this? I mean, it does look pretty epic, doesn't it? For it just to have, like, popped up out of nowhere. The Tusker! Skeps! Okay, where to now? Oh, ready for turn in. We've checked on everyone. Medrasil has safely arrived, but we must make sure our allies are also safe and sound. Yeah, okay, we did that. Rest well. I'm heartened to hear that our friends are well. Thank you for visiting them. So we can get a neck piece, which isn't an upgrade. I'll just get that one. May your dreams be peaceful. As you know, a Medrasil is no ordinary tree. Tarande, Whisperwind, and the rest of the Kaldore have been preparing to properly welcome it with a ceremony of their own and establish a new moon well. I am certain that Tarande would want you there for the dedication. Let us join them at the central encampment. Dreams guide you. Okay. Central encampment back in the Emerald Dream? Is that right? Where is... No, it's not the Emerald Dream now, there's just Emerald its own little place. Right? Yes. Okay. It's alright, we're up to speed. It just looks the same, obviously, because of the whole process. So pretty. Just checking, there's nothing... No, there's nothing really to get here other than a couple chests. And, like, a flight path. There's no like lifts or exploration needed. Oh, I 
everyone. The goddess gives me strength. Imedrasil is everything we'd hoped for. Let us properly honor its arrival. The Kaldori win in a dream. Imedrasil has been ushered into this world by the denizens of the dream. Now we must ensure its roots are bathed in the waters of Elune by creating a new moon well. So many of my people have brought us to this moment. Each should have a part in this dedication. Go speak to the Tal... Go speak to the Kaldori gathered here and see if they have offerings for the ceremony. Heed the voice of Elune. Lasara. I am honored. You have a really cool outfit, Lasara. My offering is a tabard from the Danesis, a symbol of our people's devotion and our strength. It is one of the few things I was able to save from our home. I have many fond memories of passing tabards like this to Kaldora young and old alike, and of seeing its colours draped proudly over our devoted allies as well. These memories should live on here with this moonwell. Goddess, watch over you. Greetings. White Claw and Grim Claw. I remember them. Very cute. My offering is the pendant of my beloved Anaya Dawn Runner. Dawn Runner. I have lost many close to me over my lifetime, but none so painful as my greatest love. I cannot be re reunited with her here, but perhaps her spirit can live on. A beacon of love for the Kaldori. Goddess, watch over you. It's really sweet. Great hoof. Do you need my aid? Our people have suffered much, yet they have shown courage in the face of adversity time and again. Please take the soil from the dream grove. It is a reminder of the courage displayed when we fought back the nightmare from the dream not so long ago. We have never faltered and never will. May a medrasal taste of that courage and grow stronger still. Walk in peace. My fate. I have an offering if it will be accepted. This druid talisman once belonged to my beloved. Some part of me knew that he was gone of course, but as soon as I carried his talisman, I carried the hope that we would be reunited. Hope gives us strength even in our darkest hours. May Amedrasil continue to inspire us all. Death. Okay, we actually did get into the raid. Should we do it? We'll see, there's still a few to accept it. I would really like to kill Farak before doing the end campaign, you know? You know, you know? But these blimmin' DPS aren't accepting. So, unfortunately not. We tried. I speak for my people. Have you collected all the offerings for the ceremony? Our foes will know our fury. Every Kaldori understands the grief and elation of a moment such as this, the pain we have endured and the hope we have for the future. These offerings are profound and appreciated. Elune, light your way. With these offerings and water from the Well of Eternity, we have all that we need. Speak with me when you are ready to begin the ritual. Do not lose faith. I am ready. Children of the Stars. It has been a long journey to this moment. Our people have fought, suffered, and sacrificed so much. And yet here, in the shade of Amidrasil's young boughs, we may at last begin to heal. Unto the souls who now watch over this sacred place, we offer our blessings. Symbols of dedication, strength, and love. Unto this moon well, we offer this precious vial, the last water saved from the temple of Darnassus. May they bathe Amirdrasil in a loon's radiance and bestow her blessings upon this place, Bel Ameth, the arms of the goddess. In her embrace, may the Kaldori finally know peace. Elune Adore. I 
have such a soft spot for the Kaldore because a night elf was like my first WoW character I ever played. So, also, Lemon Raid popped up while we were waiting, like while we were watching the cutscene, and now we've missed it. So, In unlucky. Her light, all truths are revealed. A Medrasil at last. It feels as if I have let go of a breath I did not realize I was holding. I cannot thank you enough for your aid. Do not lose faith. At long last, let us celebrate all that we have overcome and the hope that burns brightly amongst these gathered Kaldori. Come join the festivities. Our foes will know our fury. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Love for poor. Must pet the big doggo. Okay. What do we need to do? So food? Pick up your first meal order. And then pop it down. Cute. This is cool. Okay, you guys don't need food. Aerosol. Oh, is that? Yeah, Kedga. Almost ran right past you. I don't actually remember the others, but remember Kedga. <laughs> Dance party in the middle. Scaps is so cute. Look at him. Oh no, we saved him, right? Like he's from... Uh, the name of the zone right now is evading me, but I remember... Um, I remember him. Poor little baby no. Such a pretty zone. Here we go, my dudes. Oh, Jaina. The time for dreaming is over. Champion, it is good to see you again. It is good to see everyone. I spent many years searching for peace between the factions. Today, I feel as if perhaps we have accomplished it. For now, I only hope this unity lasts. I have a soft spot for Jaina too because we just did the whole battle for Azeroth storyline on my druid. So like she's our little friend. Be careful who you trust. Well, old friend, it felt good to share a cause and fight side by side once more. <laughs> yes, it did. Like on Mount Hyjal all those years ago. But thank the light, this world tree did not fall. Jaina. When a Mirdrasil took root on Azeroth, for a moment it was as if... Like there was... A voice? I heard it too. Ah, oh, good. I didn't imagine it. So beautiful. Like a song. It seemed to be calling out to me. Could it be the voice of the World Tree? I don't think so. It sounded far more ancient. I'm not sure how I know that. It's just a feeling. If we both heard it, felt it, maybe others did too. Perhaps. But let's leave that investigation for another day. Tonight, we celebrate our victory. All of us. Together. Together. Ominous. Okay then. It is my honor to serve Elune. Durande smiles gently. Alun smiles on us this day. For the first time in what seemed so long, I feel as if I can breathe unimpeded. Thank you. Elun, light your way. Looks drowsier. Do you ever think back to the time before the sundering, Alex Drasser? When the world was whole? I remember a time like now when night elves and dragons lived and fought side by side. 
that we faltered from within. The world itself was rent asunder. And yet we endured. I don't know why Alexstrasia doesn't have a voice. And unspeakable tragedies. The well of eternity. The legion at Mordrasil. Yet Death this wing. precious tree, a Mordrasil, has brought us together. And when I look upon the faces of those who have risen to its aid, both old and new, I see something returning that we have lost. Yes, hope. Unity. Though there is much work to be done, I know we have the strength to face anything if we face it together. Cute. A little wholesome moment. Rithra. Hello, champion. May your dreams be peaceful. So much life and joy resides here beneath these branches. May it always be so. Is it time to go already? I notice the festivities have drawn the attention of a few spriggans from Ardenweald. They are curious creatures with interesting tastes. Their pranks have been more than disruptive. Please root them out so the celebration may continue in peace. Rest well. I stand with you. Halagos, my man. You're just the person I was looking for. I'm a little concerned about Kadgar. I don't think it's anything dire, but he doesn't seem to be enjoying himself like everyone else. He just seems distracted. I don't want to pry, but perhaps you can bring him a drink for me. He may open up to you. Good luck. I can do my best, little dude. Nope. Um interesting that that just popped up we have recently just created i need to just like close that close that close that how do i close that there we go closed um we have just created our own guild which is obviously for anyone if you want to join um there'll be more information probably in the discord server but um yeah, we have a guild now. This character currently isn't in it yet, obviously, but my main is, and I'm slowly going to build it up as much as we can to have a little community, both on Discord and actually in WoW now, which I'm very excited about. I'd like a drink for Kedgar, please. Oh, Parazan twist, something delightfully sour, dark and curious, whatever Caligos is having. <laughs> whatever you recommend will do, just an ale, please, goat's milk and a skull mug. Hmm. Something dark and curious. <laughs> the poor little squirrel. Sorry, squirrel? What? Skunk. <laughs> I don't know where squirrel came from. I meant to say skunk. So cute though. A pot. Dry spiced Iscago. Yeah. In fact, I have tried escargot. I went to Evade. Rude. Um, I went to France a few years ago and tried it, and it obviously wasn't that bad. Just knowing what you're eating makes it kind of weird. Hey, Goldrun, our other buddy from our other playthrough. It's one thing I really love about doing these recordings and paying attention to the story as much as I can is like actually knowing who all these other people are now. I had no clue who Goldrun was before. Why are you bothering me? I do not have a target. I'm gonna do the last trickster and then we'll go see Kedgar. Make it quick! I need to target something first. Ah, good to see you. Kedgar frowns at something on the table. What is it that you need? I have a drink for you from Kalagos. Always. Hello, champion. 
I trust you are enjoying this well-deserved moment of celebration. It was heartening to see members of the Alliance and Horde fighting side by side for a shared cause. After the dark days of the Fourth War, I feared it would never happen again. Yet even as we relish the victory over Ferak and welcome the birth of a new world tree, members of the Kirin Tor have brought me troubling reports. Something is moving in the shadows. An ancient enemy stirs, incited by some harbinger with whom a Ritikran has dark dealings. How these forces are connected, and what they're after, I cannot say. But I've spoken with an old friend who's going to investigate. If what I suspect is truly coming to pass, Azeroth will soon need you to defend her once again. Ah, enough of my rumination. Please, return to the gathering. And let Kalagos know he doesn't need to worry about me. Okay, yeah, I don't think Kalagos is ever not going to worry about you. Also, a very ominous conversation, but I mean, when does Azeroth not need saving? Let's be real. What would you ask of me? Thank you. I appreciate their liveliness, but they are not on our guest list tonight. For a Mudrasil. I'm glad you've come. Thank you, friend. I knew he'd speak to you. Maybe now we can both relax. Oh my god, we still have a level 300 ring. So it's haste mastery, haste versatility, crit. I'm gonna go for the crit. Come back soon. Tell me of your dreams. My mother asked for us all to meet her by the moonwell. It has been long enough, we should not keep her waiting. Speak with me there. Ooh, gift of a Mildrasil. The dream must be protected. I'm ready to leave the party. The party was cute. Jaina, what's up the this time? The true battle lies ahead. You know, we never had a celebration after Hyjal. Back then, we had as much to lament as we did to celebrate. Our victory came at such a great cost. We were all just weary. What little energy we had left was spent tending to our wounded and moving to our respective homes. I'm glad that this time we could afford to celebrate. I am going to sound super noob right now. I didn't realize she was part of, I'm guessing, Cataclysm, because that's where Mount Hyjal is, right? Because we did battle for Azeroth, to be fair, she is basically captured at the start of that story. Spoiler alert if you haven't played it. Um, so that makes sense. There's obviously something happened that made that happen, you know? Like she was captured for a reason. Because everyone thought she betrayed them. Oh, her mom thought she... Ah, oh, I can't remember. It's been, it's, been a, it's been a minute. We all have our ghosts. Jaina. Kalik. I'm sorry I haven't reached out sooner. Not to worry. You've been more than a little busy. Reuniting your family and serving Kol Tiras as Lord Admiral. What about you? You have your aspectral powers again. And you brought the Blues home, Kalik. I know how much that meant to you. I think we both needed to make a journey. Just not together. And that's all right. It is. Do you have some time? I'd like you to meet some friends of mine. But I must warn you, they'll probably insist that you try their soup. And they like <laughs> to use eel guts. I'm called Tyrion, remember? I grew up on eel liver soup. It sounds wonderful. <laughs> okay, definitely picking up on a vibe there. Cute as heck. I love both of them. Imagine the, like, little babies they would make. Mm. Like she said, she's from Kalturus. She can deal with the Tuskar and all their weird fish. Our flight stands unified once more. Marithra takes a breath and sets her shoulders. Are you ready, champion? May your dream... I am so grateful we had this time together. My 
my beloved friends. With the aid of those gathered here, a Myrdrasil blossoms all around us. Do you remember when you first held its seed in your arms, Tyrande? Of course. I cradled it as I would a child, and promised the souls within to honor their sacrifice. And I swore to you, I would do everything in my power to protect it. We have both kept our vows. It is time I return to Ardenweald, to restore the balance and repay a debt to an old friend. Mother, I thought you came back to ensure that I would... My precious child, you are strong, compassionate, and wise. And you have become the leader I knew you would. You did not need me to guide you. Mother, I will always need you. I shall not be far. I am so, so proud of you, my heart. Remember, all time is borrowed. And in this, there is beauty. All is well. Where there is life, there is hope. As a Mirdrasil blooms into Azeroth beyond the dream, my sister takes on the middle, the mantle of a new aspect. Alexstrasia glances at where the portal was and smiles. And you have drawn all these events to a happy conclusion. Safeguard all life. Defenders of the dream. Okay, we've done everything. I'm, we're going to have to go do the just like the exploration and the glyphs. Oh my god, we did everything. What is it you seek? It's been a long road for us all, but after persevering through hardship and strife, Dragonkind stands poised to enter a new age. Before you leave for your next adventure, my fellow Aspects and I wish to thank you for all you have done for us. From pain we draw strength. Okay, so we need to go back to... Um... Valdraken for that little hand in, but first, okay. My father's over this way. Um, but first, I want to go back to the Emerald Dream and get everything finished off. Also, how amazing is it that they now have their own little town again? This is so cool. And there's even like some quests here. Is that an enchanter? Oh, is that an enchanter? Be careful. There are some exciting orders to fill this week. The students at Al Githar Academy have been going horns over heels for those fun scepters. Why don't you assist with some of the scepters? I don't know what that means, but sure, we'll pick it up. We're an enchanter. Alrighty, let's get our butts back to the Emerald Dream. Oh wow. The sky. Crazy. Crazy pretty. I've already picked up all of these before, so like we don't have to worry about that. Although maybe not completely all, I'm not sure. We can I can always do that. It's some other stage. But let's go. I can't believe like this is gonna be the last part for our warlock like our warlock is officially done 
That is just bonkers to me. Okay, let's glyph over here. Come get this one. First, and then we have to go explore over here and get this glyph. And then I think that's on it, there's one over here too. So we don't have too much more to do. But yeah, like my warlock, like this character, is the one we started with. Like, my first ever WoW playthrough was on this warlock. Where is this new foe is too powerful to face alone. Gather what forces you can find and remove this threat. I was just assume the glyph is like as high as possible. Need to be like here. Right? No. Like here. These trees don't make it easy to find. Aha, there we go. Wink. Righty, this way. Yeah, it just feels so odd that she's done. Like we we played her through a whole bunch of oh wow the super blooms on whole bunch of cataclysm or like the old world change via cataclysm and then all of the dragon isles including the incursion oh, wow. has upset the balance of this ecosystem ease the frenzy of the local turtles um all of the dragon isles including the sojourner We've just done so much on this character. Like I've never, I don't think I've ever played so much storyline on a single character before. Okay, we have one more glyph over here. I think that's the last one. Like the last one for all of the Dragon Isles, as far as I'm aware. Because we have gotten them f for every other zone. I'm still sad we haven't actually killed him yet. <laughs> Living for Ark. It's been a pain in the butt the whole time we've been here. Like the whole time on the Dragon Isles. He killed me many a time when I got distracted in certain zones. I hate to admit. Alrighty. What's the way? It's out in the middle of the sea. We'll land for a second because it's over there somewhere. Oh, it's here somewhere. Where is it? Oh, I don't think we can make it up there. We can't. Crap, okay. Switching to a normal mount. <laughs> Here we go, last one! You hear Emerald Dream, Emerald Dream, Emerald Dream Glyph Hunter. So we've got Glyph Hunter for every zone. Yeah, the only thing I haven't really done is the racing because I suck at it. Oh, I've been reached Glyph Hunter. What did I miss one? Oh my god, I did. That's no good. Okay, that must be the last one. I remember last time telling you guys that like 
we like nearly have everything unlocked. But we're short one. Yeah, we're short one because of the forbidden rate. Oh, that's fine. I will go do that myself. I won't make you guys watch me fly to the forbidden range. Like, can you believe we're done? I can't believe we're done. I can't believe this is the last part on my warlock because I love her so much. And I have such a little, little soft spot for her. But guys, if you made it to the end of this video, thank you so, so much. If you've made it through this entire playthrough, please comment below because I'm so curious and I would love to know if you watched 61 parts. That means you've watched about 61 hours roughly of me playing this game, which is mind blowing. I would, I do really appreciate your support, every single one of you who watches these videos, likes these videos, has subscribed to my channel, has joined my Discord server, and has helped me create a guild. You guys are amazing. As an FYI, I upload videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, so don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss the next part of our new journey now. I will see you all very soon. Bye guys.